problem I find is that many people have, in a way, left out the pelvis or are not moving the pelvis very well. Um, we live in a, a chair culture. A lot of our times we're sitting in a chair. And when you're sitting in a chair, a chair is very comfortable and efficient for supporting you. So you can just sit there and you can end up just sitting there all day, which means your pelvis is not moving. And the circulation, the blood flow tends to reduce to that area. Um, also that well, muscles and tendons and ligaments just tend to stiffen up because you're not moving very much. And then you go to move, you start to move and oh, oh, it's, it's not very mobile. Is it different? In fact, continue on, go side to side, gently, easily, a small, comfortable movement, looking a little to the left, a little to the right to explore what it's like to turn your head and how that travels through your neck. And maybe you can move your awareness down the spine to find when you're turning your head, maybe there's change in the shoulders, the chest, the middle back, maybe even down to the lower back. Maybe the pelvis moves in response to your head turning, or maybe it doesn't. You're just simply noticing what you're doing.